Oh, yeah, that's usually for me. I'm, I'm doing it. I'm like, that's why I work on my jump shot. Man. The shoot around looked like you guys were working on an inbound play and some variations of it. I thought you guys executed it twice in the first half. How yeah. good is it to carry that over from practice and the games being such a nice uh, team? Listen to Friday, man. Everybody listen to me. Do their job there. Yeah, everyone going to follow the place. God wants this. I'm going to Got better. Me and Sterling from each other, I would say. Because he can score easy, very easy. So we got kind of more touches. From playing in Rupp to even being interviewed now, how is the transition going from playing high school basketball not so long ago to that? Complete now? difference. I'm, I'm glad I'm in it right now. Complete difference. Uh, just more, the atmosphere is more crazy. Everybody more intense now. Got really play deep. Everybody's good. Everybody's good. Like I said, like Kansas, North Carolina. You got to come out every day. Is there a guard that you're not always in? I'll say Chris Paul. Oh, yeah, all the time. I talk to Aaron, Andrew, all of them. Tyler, Isaiah. I talk to all of them all the time. John Wall, all of them. Do you give any good advice? Oh, they told me to come in and work. Don't take nothing for granted, really. Just come in every day, get better every day. Every day you got to go on the upper step. What average you think Deep to overall, I say it was a two today. It was a, it was, I think it was on, on my part. Um, everybody ball bombing, they're getting open shots. So I take I take full responsibility for that. What are some of the things you guys can do better defensively? Oh, uh, we got to talk more, really. We talk in practice. I don't, I don't know why we wasn't talking today. But we, like, we're going to see tomorrow and, and on the film who wasn't talking, who was talking, who was, who was in the right spot, who wasn't. So we're going to see tomorrow. Cal said that he was really looking forward to watching the film mm -hmm. this time and, and seeing, you know, how you guys did more up close. Yeah. How is it for you guys as players during uh, this it film helps session? Us. It helps us because you can't make the same mistake. If he tell you once, don't 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 make the same mistake again. So film really breaks everything down. What you what you look look what you look what you at look where you at and it, it just shows you next time in practice you gotta get where you gotta get. Are you sitting there kind of hoping that he doesn't single you out? Oh, Is no, that what everybody? I, 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 want him to be, I want him to be hard on me more than anything because I'm the point guard. Really. Cause once he be hard on me, everybody's going to go, oh, yeah, he's hard on Q all the time. And he's going to be hard on anybody, so it doesn't matter. Q, your first game uh, against outside competition. Yeah. Is it finally good to not battle each other? I oh, it's finally good to play against somebody, beat them on somebody else. We just, we just prepare for that Kansas game. That's all. <laughs> so right now. We're talking about how fun this is. I mean, it's fun to watch. Talking about how fun this, this team is. Oh, it's, we get up and down real fast. Everybody can dribble, can shoot, and everybody can dunk except for me. But I like throwing lobs and everybody dunk. And I, I, just, I just love it. Why did it make this job look like you know, why prepping for the Kansas game? Oh, that's, that's, that's the first big game coming up, so we got to prep for that. We got to get, gotta get ready every day, upper scale every day, every day. Every practice, every game, water, off, off the court, every day. Got to prep for that. Coach was uh, telling us uh, Questioning the conditioning of the team, the guys who can't play 40 minutes a game right now. How, uh, what sort of level of conditioning do you think you guys are in? Uh, I think we had a, we had a uh, two, I think. I think we had a, uh, between the two and the five. A five. Oh, it's, it, it depends who it is, who's, who's up and down the court. It depends what we're doing. Your coach tells you to give it up early so you can get it back. Is that sort of uh, no, nah, in high school I used to give him the ball like that. I didn't really have nobody on my team. But I mean, it's kind of, he had been over right now. So really, it's just, I play a more better player than I, than I ever dreamed about. <laughs> even, even at camp, I didn't have these many people on my team. Really. So it's just, it's just, you get the ball out of my, my hands fast and get them more touches. Though. That's all I do. How much for you guys? It seemed like, especially early on, with trying to get the low post going. Yeah. Establish people. Yeah, we try to get the big man rolling it, though. I tried to get them to say the team would be playing little, so we had no choice to get the protection for that. Get the warm up so they on the oven, they can they can help us out block some shots and stuff. <laughs> and, and there was a time in the first half where Cal called and, and uh, Thomas Moore had closed with him seven. And seven, yeah. Yeah. And the next play down, you drew a lob, and I can't remember. I who think was it? Nick uh, was Nick. it Nick? Yeah, it was Nick. He was pressing it. I threw it to Nick. I wondered if Cal thought you guys had gotten away from dominating. Oh no, we just we just we seen so we got attacking, that's what she saw the attack it was the first thing. Fast shoot or draw. How good do you guys how good are you guys in transition? 
Oh, we're real good. So we start got some more things to work on. Everybody got new water. I mean, I see it. So we're going we to work on that. What, what about the press to start the game? Cal said that was more of a conditioning drill than yeah. anything else. But do you yeah, I think, think I think that's why he did it too, so we get conditioned. In it. That's, I think I think that's really why he did it. He, did, he, he we, we was doing it in practice that day, but we didn't know he was going to do it today, right away off the off the off the tip. So it was good today. Do you think that's something you guys will be able to utilize this year? Oh yeah, we nice and long. Everybody tall, something. <laughs> So, but I, I got to do a better job on defensive end. So, they, so I can help them guy they can help me too. Since right now you guys can't play, according to Cal, three or four minutes at a time and that's it. But do you think you can press for three or four minutes at a time to maybe, you know, mix up the pace a little bit? Uh, so? It would happen today. So, he, he, he had to see what was, what was going on. So. Coach said right now he's comfortable with three, maybe four people leading the break. How many players would you say right now are capable I, of running I fast break? Them, except for the big man. Wayne can lead the break, give it up early, get it back. Everybody can except for Nick and Sasha. Wayne called Kevin a, a silent assassin. Is oh, that yeah. kind of a fair way to yeah, describe he score his game? He scores so quiet. Yeah. See, yeah, well, how much he had today? Like 25, I think? 27. 27, 12 yeah. Off 12 shots. That's it. Boop. There we go. <laughs> Very quiet.